joining me today is love guys that, that's just all i can say I, i even said to them please can you lay hands on me because i want the anointing that they are carrying of love listen the, you know how we do the interviews one aruk one aruk like this is the first time they've been separated and they wanted to sit together oh my goodness guys this is love is in the air i'm sitting with sharon and elad cherai oh my goodness what an honor to have you on the show good morning elad good morning sharon you look gorgeous in green thank you <laughs> and i hope you're feeling gorgeous too i am thank fantastic you so fantastic <laughs> now let's get straight into it let's jump straight into it you know i i did okay. um mention the issue of love and you guys not being separate and as uh, worship leaders and as ministers mm-hmm. i mean you know i'm in the i'm in the choir okay right. and you know sometimes think you how do you guys manage that chemistry how do you gel and how do you allow each other to flourish in the individual gifts that god has given you as a unit i'll direct that to you elad okay um i think one of the most important things to do is to realize your strengths and your weaknesses in a marriage marriage is not about competition it's about <laughs> complementing one wow. another and um, that's what we do mm-hmm. and um I, i know that she's more gifted than i am wow. in terms of singing and stuff so i let her be mm-hmm. so whenever we go in an environment where it requires us to sing i, I let her take the lead uh-huh. and um when it, it she also knows that you know what what the bible says it say humble yourselves women respect your husbands submit to yeah. to see and she does that mm-hmm. and i i think that's that's the reason why we are what we are because of those boundaries of those things that we have set for one another and knowing that she's better she's better in this way and she's good mm-hmm. better than me yeah yeah and and how do you feel when your husband says i'm not going to make better than me <laughs> <laughs> It's an honor actually because mm-hmm. I think uh, most musicians some of them I might not really mention by name you can tell cuz when they were single mm-hmm. they used to sing but then once they got married that they stops. disappeared and then you're like what happened could be that maybe because I got a balance mm-hmm. but I think God for him because he also give, give me my space yes. gives me my space to to be myself yeah. and I also know his strengths especially when it comes to knowing the bible preaching and everything else I'm like I I have no idea That's what is this area. <laughs> it was is a moving bible but uh-huh. like I'm, I just need to know a lot of things and I ask him a lot of questions. Mm-hmm. He knows you tell you but I'm, I'm I'm always asking about almost anything. That what does this mean? What does what, where do you get this because I know he he knows better than me in that area as well. That is beautiful. And you know what I I do see I do see what you're saying in real life. You know sometimes we can say ah, he's just saying in in the song um yeah. 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 when you watch that performance even when you come on yeah. it's like you've allowed her to kind of take it and yeah. then you just come okay Ava, then yeah. let her go. I'm here so to support. You, yeah. You're there to support and it's yeah. a true embodiment of really what God has called you to be as ministers mm-hmm. of his word mm-hmm. and ministers uh, of his word through yeah, worship. Through worship. Mm-hmm. Now, you guys have a uh, concert coming up. Yes. Yes, we do. I'm really excited about this. What is this concert about? Yeah. Well, um it's called the God the Lifter of Men. Mm-hmm. Uh it's going to be on the 26th of October uh 2024. happening at the uh, Harare show grounds oh, in the uh, Eastern, Eastern Hall. Hall. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yes, we're going to be having um kind of uh, big names uh-huh. on the on the lineup, on the lineup. and um, Minister Mahendere, Minister Tech Show. We also have um Yasham Tonori. Mm-hmm. We have uh, Matthias, Matthias yes, Mere, and also we have uh, the UK based Eliana Makombe. Oh, wow. And my mas but Wait a minute, I'm missing on this lineup. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking, but okay, God God the lifter of man i mean that's a quite a yakadzama that yes. um theme yes. what inspired it okay so what inspired god the lift of men we basically we looked at our life our life together mm-hmm. and um before we even got married and where god took us where where we started from mm-hmm. you know there are moments that when you look at your life and you and you say how did i get here wow. and you see the hand of the lord lifting you up in a in a mighty way god opening doors for you and that inspired um that uh, that title god the lift of men to say mara chiri kusimudza vanhu mara chiri kuvhura pakavharwa mara chiri kuporesa vanhu and because of that um uh, that's when we we then said ah, let's let's name this god the lift of men 
so that when people come to that concert, mm -hmm. they come to have an experience of of a God that still uplifts, a God that still heals, a God that still, uh, you know, takes you from that lowly place um, and sits you with princes and kings. Wow, that yeah. is incredible. And you speaking about your journey, um, about, you know, how you met. Please, more on that information, please. <laughs> how did you then realize... Good Brother Ella, <laughs> <laughs> Sister Sharon, running him up. Yes, how did, how was that? Right? But uh, then he came, he joined Zimpraise. Oh, right. Zim I think I got in way before him. And when he got in, mm -hmm. that's when we just started talking. I, I was supposed to do a song, mm -hmm. but then he came and he tried the song and he did it better than I. <laughs> and then the uh, leader of Zimpraise was like, you need, you need to teach him. So oh. then I got his number and he said, hello, hi. And then I go, hi. So I thought he wanted to have a conversation, but I was just going to teach him a song. And that's it. And that was You it. were that sister. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And I, yeah. I could say, well, maybe it was because I was like feeling like, mm, this guy, if I entertain him, I'm probably going to fall. But then I was like, let me put boundaries. <laughs> so then uh, with time, when we were going to the, to the UK and uh, tour UK and America, mm -hmm. we sat in the bus. Uh -huh. Going to South Africa, uh -huh. who or Atambos, then we were going to catch up a flight today. He sat beside me, and the, the first thing he says to me is, like, I want to marry you. No, die. <laughs> yes, I did. <laughs> Just like that. Just, Just like that. And you knew. You know how people say, what God says, told me. Or how did you know? Um, mm -hmm. You know, way before, like, those days that we used to meet up, I, I would wake up in the morning and I would, you know, sometimes you do the morning devotion and you're, you're praying for your life. And then I find myself praying for her. Oh, wow. I find myself praying for a marriage, a future. <laughs> like, why, why, why is that I'm praying for this person? <laughs> but then I, I, I just said, okay, I think this one, you go in India, and you have sweet, and this one, you know. It was a choice. For me, it was a choice. I don't want to lie. It was uh -huh. a choice. Yeah. I just said, ah, we don't move and then that's that, and that was it. God the lifter of man Joshua yeah. guys I mean did we hear that story yeah. absolutely fantastic <laughs> now you speak about US uh, the US and the UK and mm -hmm. uh, I wanted to touch on your relationship with Eliana All right. how did that come about did she help, help facilitate for you to go to the UK or how did that come about well she was uh, um, planning the grateful concert the yes, first one yes, it was the yes. first time right yeah. and um, her considering us to be on the Amongst it the ministers, it was an honor, wow. yeah. and we ended up going there, getting, getting to know each other more. Aside from just us being on stage and singing together, yeah. we got to know each other off the off the, off stage. the stage. Actually, she is, and uh, they are um, an, amazing an amazing couple. couple. Wow! That and their kids amazing. love me so much. And it's just, <laughs> I'm telling you, those guys, they're just, you know, they're people that when you are around them, mm -hmm. you yeah. you get inspired yes. by how they do things, by mm -hmm. how they've managed to. Up, set up their lives yeah. and that's one thing that we that we get whenever we are with them yeah. whenever mm -hmm. we are with the husband and the wife the way mm -hmm. that they take their music seriously mm -hmm. apart from the music the way they raise their family mm -hmm. apart from raising their family the way they do business they're right. hardworking they're hardworking hard it's just amazing mm -hmm. so us going there to grateful it, it, it's not about you know the concert side you know but we we ended up gaining family and yes friends. that is beautiful yeah. um now speaking of gospel the gospel back home now Tanzoga was Zimbabwe <laughs> what is your take on the local gospel uh scene do you want me to take it yeah I'll or take both it. of you will <laughs> <laughs> take it um, <laughs> we 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 are going there we are slowly Getting baby there. steps mm -hmm. we are getting there you know um back in the days there used to be you know very few gospel artists but now you know the the pool is becoming bigger and bigger and we are having different genres and, and god is blessing our nation now yeah. we have upcoming artists that are rising we also have these big artists we also in the same era we have those artists that were big in the days and now they are legends and we look at them the likes of Mabenda Mai Charamba mm, which we draw inspiration inspired, from right, yes, and right. it's a blessing as a mm. nation though you you would desire for it to be more uh, you would desire for us to 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 you know to grow more mm -hmm. but with what we have at, at the moment we thank God that is that is absolutely fantastic mm. now uh, I mean, you may not have time to put yeah, in yeah. your thoughts because we only have a few minutes That's left right. but um, you're topping radio 
charts and stuff. How does that make you feel? Oh, you know, guys, uh, we, we really are something. Just in two seconds, how does that make you We're feel? We're grateful. It's uh, good to know that people actually appreciate your ministry mm -hmm. and they're being blessed by it. Right. We've received so many testimonies from people, mm -hmm. especially on the song Farawe Moe Wangu. Yeah. Uh, there's never a day people don't, they, they text us, you know how it is. Yeah. And we are grateful for what God is doing through our ministry yeah. to the, in the lives of people. And I, and I do also understand mm -hmm. that you've crossed borders as well. Yes. Mozambique is... Yes, ma'am. Konapo, konapo, ipapo, ipapo, Bazetian Prime, DSTV Channel 294. The place to be.